Well, the Ruston City Council approving several projects tonight, including the North Frontage Road West Striping Project and airport improvements. Gabby Ballou gives us a rundown. Ruston City Council has officially entered into a contract to start the North Frontage Road West Striping Project. The striping will include three entrances at the new J.P. Morgan Chase building currently under construction. Mayor Ronnie Walker says how the road will look once the construction is complete. As soon as you turn off Tech Drive onto the service road, it's, one, it's going to be one lane because one will be closed. Then it'll have a service, I mean a uh, turn lane, and it'll go all the way past Chase right down the hill and then becomes regular two-lane road. Mayor Walker says the project is expected to cost over $33,000 and the striping is expected to start within the next few weeks and is only supposed to last a few days. Mayor Walker explains how the striping will improve the road. For one thing, it'll help with traffic flow. Then also, all of a sudden, when you get uh, industry or business that's hiring 150, 200 people, then there's going to be a lot of traffic coming and going. So this really will help the safety on that road and make it much easier. The City Council will also enter into a contract to make improvements at the Ruston Regional Airport, adding 10 new tea hangers along with two companies building large private hangers. Over $1 million of the funding is coming from the Federal Aviation Administration. And Senator Bill Cassidy also announced the city has been awarded $300,000 for the project. Mayor Ronnie Walker explains how these improvements will help the city. It also affects it sim simply uh, the, the city and of course the two universities with Louisiana Tech and Gramlin because they always are bringing people in and need, the hangars are needed for that, the taxiway area is needed. So as we grow, as the universities grow, we will continue to try to grow our airport also. The city is hoping the project will start within the next three months. In Ruston, I'm Gabby Ballou with KNOE 8 News.